the first feature I want to talk about is depth sensing. So depth sensing is the first step to providing believable interactions with the real world environment. And what it does, it provides a continuous depth map of, the, of what the camera can see to your code. So this enables virtual objects to interact with the real world. For example, you could use this depth map to do stuff with your physics engine. Or you could have a virtual object, such as a virtual cartoon character, walking behind the table legs of a table, or walking behind another person, or disappearing behind a wall. So this is a really, this gives a really believable sense that the object is part of the scene, rather than always being placed on top of it.